continues next on TV News at 6, including piles of cars littering cities and bridges swept out to sea. The latest on the cleanup after massive and deadly flooding swept through Spain. Really behind Prop 34? Sleazy Sacramento politicians trying to trick you into spending millions, trying to silence groups like the National Organization for Women and the AIDS Healthcare Foundation. The LA Times calls Prop 34 a sleazy abuse and warns voter beware. The San Francisco Chronicle calls Prop 34 cheap political gamesmanship. The San Diego Tribune says it's bad precedent that weaponizes ballot measures. Don't let sleazy politicians take away your voice. Vote no on Prop 34. Precision is an excellent company. We had an idea of what we wanted, but we weren't sure how to put it together. It's kind of one of those things that I personally take pride in, making sure that the people make the right decision. We highly recommend Precision. Precision door service, a name you can trust. How do you flush away $1.7 million? Just ask the seven city commissions in charge of approving the construction of a single public toilet. That's right, one toilet. 1.7 million dollars. Is it any wonder San Francisco was rated the worst run city in America? Mayor Breed and the Board of Supervisors made a mess. On election day, let's flush City Hall. Vote yes on D, no on E. The heater's broken. I'll get my tools. Does your family suffer from fixititis syndrome? You working? Relief is yeah. just a call away. Service Champions is now offering $58 furnace tune-up <laughs> yeah. called 800 5 champs Everyone knows a guy like Daniel Lurie. Inherited a fortune. Thinks he's qualified for anything. A trust fund guy. Lurie said he would cut homelessness. He made it worse. His programs passed out tents, creating large tent encampments, and inflated their success rates to get taxpayer funding. One of his programs was even referred to the FBI for criminal investigation. Want to clean up London Breed's mess? Don't trust the trust fund guy. Vote no on Daniel Lurie. The Oakland Roots are in the playoffs. Don't miss a minute of the action as the Roots start their quest for the USL Championship. The Roots take on the Colorado Spring Switchbacks. Saturday at 5, only on KTVU+. Plus. Next at 6 o'clock, five days until Election Day, and former President Trump and Vice President Harris pay visits to the West as tens of millions of people nationwide have already cast their ballots. And trick-or-treating is in full swing in many neighborhoods, and police are reminding parents to watch out for their kids on the streets tonight. And Halloween celebrations for adults. San Francisco City leaders hope a holiday block party might be the boost that downtown needs. This is KTV Fox 2 News at six. Well, city leaders have been trying all kinds of ideas to help revive downtown streets as San Francisco recovers from the pandemic. Good evening. I'm Claudine Wong. And I'm Greg Lee. We begin tonight with that party called the Nightmare on Front Street. KTV Zach Sauce is live in San Francisco where Zach looks like that party is already ripping and roaring. Yeah, still relatively early, but as you can see, the ghosts, the goblins, they are already out. A live look at what the city has coined Nightmare on Front Street, San Francisco, as you mentioned, hoping to capitalize on the success of Oktoberfest by bringing back the entertainment zone here to this neighborhood. So what does that look like? Well, you got to sneak 